The Oprah invasion is well and truly underway, with the US television star finally touching down. In the end, it wasn't Sydney, but Queensland that welcomed one of the world's most famous women. Oprah Winfrey finally arrives, and Hamilton Island is playing host. What are you going to do while you're here, Oprah? Everything I can. Everything I can. But Cairns was where she first touched down on Australian soil. Waiting for her was a small group of local fans. I don't know whether she'll come close enough, but I'll do anything. <laughs> but the talk show queen wasn't to be seen. Well, only by a lucky few. She only came out for a split second, and all she did was come out and say, Hello! And then that was it. Oprah was given the star treatment. No lining up at customs. They came to her. Yeah, it's a bit of a letdown, mate. Yeah, you know, we came here to have a look at her. Hopefully she'd get off and uh, say good day. But even if she just opened the door and waved, it'd be wonderful. Come say hello, come meet my dogs. The only dog meeting Oprah was on duty. She actually petted one of the customs dogs. She actually requested that. The dog oh. went back on board to be petted by Oprah. And then it was off to see more animals in action. Well, I have been here one hour and I've seen two koalas mating already. <laughs> Three million dollars in government funding launched this Oprah odyssey designed to lure more international tourists to Australia. Her American audience members are travelling around the country. Some are in the Northern Territory to take in some Aboriginal rock art. <laughs> Oprah Winfrey is due to make her only official public appearance with the Prime Minister in Melbourne on Friday. Adrian Rochella, ABC News.